the holder of the hunter. In any city, in any country, go to a university campus and speak to the librarian. One would have asked for the section on the holder of the hunter. The librarian would have given you a dooming glance, as if to say, It's your funeral. She would have led you deep into the shelves of the library and would have brought you down a row, deep within the shelves that nobody ever noticed. Among these shelves was a large oak door. This was your last chance to turn away. Through the door was a grand library. The room was a maze. You could not see over the maze, for the ceilings were low. The lights were dim, so that the guardians would move among the shadows, waiting for a chance to devour your soul. This would have been prevented by moving, even at a dead end, and never stopping for anything, until you would have reached the center clearing. That is, if you ever found it. You would have known when you reached the center, because a warm light would have emitted from the entrance. This is a sign the holder has deemed you worthy of being in his presence. In the clearing, you would have seen a tall, lanky figure before you. He wore suit pants, a dress shirt, and a vest. His face was shrouded in shadows. A pocket watch was in his front pocket. The man would have stood in the center of a study. You would have asked him, Who seeks the seekers? He would have slipped into the shadows as the fire goes out. You would have shown no fear, for the guardians still lurked nearby. You would feel long, cold, bony hands rest on your shoulders. If you heard ticking at this point, you were doomed. If not, the holder would respond by flashing the deaths of thousands of seekers who have entered his study before your very eyes. You would have been forced to watch as shadows, demons, and other holders slaughtered the seekers. If your mind did not go insane from this process, the holder would have bestowed upon you a featureless silver pocket watch. The watch cannot be opened and is silent. Only when another object gets near it does it begin to tick again. This pocket watch is object 2525 of 2538. Seek and you shall find no more.